Jai Hind children, welcome back to the next session of our EVS online class. Hope all are fine and safe at your home. Today we are going to start the fourth lesson in our EVS textbook. The name of our lesson is We Need Shelter. In this lesson we will learn about different types of houses and the materials used to make different types of houses. Children, we all need a house. Why do we need a house? Yes, we need a house to live in. We need a house to live in. Children, houses are of two types. Kacha house and a pakka house. Kacha house is not so strong. It is made of mud and a straw. But Pakka house is very strong. It is made of bricks and cement. A house protects us from heat, cold, wind, rain and wild animals. A house protects us from heat, cold, wind, rain and wild animals. Children, do you know about the earlier houses? Many years ago, people used to live in caves. Later, they built houses. They used mud, straw and stones to build houses. Then, what are houses made of? In villages, some houses are made of mud and straw. Such houses are kacha houses. What are kacha houses? Houses made of mud and straw are called kacha houses. Kacha houses are not so strong. Children, in towns and cities, most houses are made of bricks and cement. Such houses are pakka houses. What are pakka houses? Houses made of bricks and cement are called pakka houses. Pakka houses are stronger than kacha houses. Nowadays, pakka houses are also found in villages. Thus, houses are made of different materials such as straw, mud, dry leaves, bamboo, wood, bricks, cement and stones. Then types of houses. There are different types of houses. Huts. Huts are mostly found in villages. They have one room. Huts are not very strong. They are made of mud and straw. They have to be rebuilt or repaired every year. Number two, bungalows. Bungalows are mostly found in towns and cities. They are big houses. They have many rooms. Some bungalows have a garden. They are very strong. It is made of bricks, cement and wood. Then, multi-storied buildings. Multi-storied buildings are mostly found in big cities. These buildings have many houses. These houses are called flats or apartments. They are built one on top of another. They are also very strong. We need shelter. See what a beautiful house these birds are making. Yes, they are building this nest to lay eggs. Nikki, do you know that like birds and other animals, we also need a house to live in? A house gives us shelter. 
It protects us from heat, cold, rain, wild animals and storm. It also protects us from thieves and stray animals. Yes, Kriti, I know that the house in which we live with our family is our home. Living together teaches us to love and help one another. Are all houses the same, Kriti? No, dear. There are different types of houses. They are the kacha houses and the pakka houses. A kacha house is made of things like wood, straw, bamboo, mud and dry leaves. Such houses are mostly found in villages. They are also called huts. Pakka houses are mostly found in towns and cities. They are made of things like cement, bricks, iron, concrete and wood. We live in a pakka house. It is a bungalow. It usually has a large garden in front. An apartment is also a pakka house. It has many flats in it. My friend Rina lives in a single story house. That is also a pakka house, isn't it? Yes, Nikki. Small families live in them. What about multi storied buildings? Well, they are very tall buildings with lots of apartments. Many families live in them. These buildings have lifts for moving up and down. A good house is neat and clean. It must have many doors and windows to let in the sunlight and fresh air. There must be lots of plants around it. It must also have a dustbin to throw the waste. Okay children, once again, a house protects us from heat, cold, rain, wind and wild animals. Kacha houses are made of mud and straw. Pakka houses are strong houses made of bricks and cement. Houses are made of different materials such as straw, mud, dry leaves, bamboo, wood, bricks, cement and stones. People live in different types of houses like huts, bungalows, flats, etc. Okay children, we will be continue with the rest of the lesson in the next class. Stay safe at home. Thank you.